everyone, welcome back. And today we are here for another vlog. It is currently about to storm, so if you hear any thunder in the background, I apologize. But yeah, we don't have much planned for today. Um, it's about to storm, as I said, so we're gonna be doing a lot of inside training. We have a water test coming up that I really need to get some things nailed down for Duke and Boomer. So we're gonna work on some things inside that we can. And then Molly, got um, neglected this past weekend uh, because we had a dog show, so I didn't get to brush her for a few days. So I'm going to show you what that process looks like with Molly's coat. And Molly's the type of girl that if you don't brush her for a few days, you can really tell. So I'm gonna show you how I brush her. I'm gonna show you what I spray on her coat before I brush her and how I dilute it and the conditioner and all that stuff. So that is on the schedule for today. And so yeah, we'll see, nothing big. But yeah, let's get the day started. All right, with Duke today, I really need to nail down his um, taking a line out and around something. That is an exercise in junior take a line is what it's called. And that's when they take a rope out to a person. And while he'll do that 70% of the time, 70% of the time, I really just want to nail that down. Um, and so we're going to work on out and around now this marker is symbolizing a person and then I'm going to give him this and he's supposed to go out and around it and then we're going to work on some basic control which is basic healing on the beach staying with with you a recall so that is also what we're going to work on with him today um so yeah let's get started to train anything water with Duke I use these Tyson like diced chicken it's already cut up and everything that's what I use with him when I'm training anything water or anything that needs to be a little high value that's what i'm using i'm going to start close with him take it around Something else I really want to nail down with him is pulling something and bringing it to me. So I'm going to hook up a take a line to a life ring so that he pulls a bit of weight back to me. I want him to deliver it to hand. He will go grab it, pull it, and then it gets fuzzy around when he gets like four feet from me. So we really want to nail that down as well. Just going to pull this to me as, as it has a little drag to it. Stay. Probably gonna pull up all these yoga mats, but oh, right here. Go take it. Bring it right here, dude. Pull, pull, pull. Right here, buddy. Right here. Right here. Pull, pull. Oh my God. Pull. Uh oh. Yes. So I'm clicking for delivering to hand because that's where he struggles. He doesn't struggle pulling. It's just. He'll drop it, usually if it's the boat. So we're gonna do that again. Duke, sit, wait. Go. Go take it. I love the enthusiasm, I really do. Bring it right here. Pull, pull, right here, pull, stop. Right here, bring it all the way here, pull. Oh, that was wonderful. I love that. So that's just repetition, a lot of repetition. Now we're gonna work on some basic control. So that is a basic healing pattern and a recall. So we're gonna work on that right now. All right, come here. Yo. Right here. 
now I'm going to do a recall as I'm pretty happy with his healing right now and I don't want to push it with him today. Do you stay? with how Duke just did. He knows the exercises, we just haven't nailed them down. Um, Cause I never had to do that with Boomer, he just always did it. Now Duke, I really need to make sure he understands, he knows what I'm talking about because with him, he's never being defiant, he just doesn't understand. And so I need to make sure the lines are very clear and so that's why land training is huge for um, getting your homework done at home and then when you go out to the lake you just transfer it over instead of like trying to build a behavior at the lake so I love with the added distraction so I love doing a ton of land work so like your tickets holds dragging stuff all that can be done at home first and then it's so simple and easy to transfer it to in the water so a double retrieve is when a kayak will come and they'll drop two articles. That is a life jacket and a cushion. And the dog goes out and gets one article, brings it back to you on shore, and then you send them out to the second article. And it's all one exercise. You can't touch them at all, only vocal commands. And they have to deliver both to hand. So um, he's pretty good at this. This is a level two exercise, so WRD, which is what I'm working towards with Boomer. Even though we've started on X, which a lot of y'all have seen in our um, vlogs as well. So yeah, this is a WRD exercise and so we're going to just kind of nail that down on land today. He does have this down. He doesn't struggle with this, but since he's dying to work, let's just pull him out. Boomer, get the jacket. So we are going to be brushing Molly out today. If we don't brush her for a few days, she can get this um, dead hair all over her. She's not in horrible shape, but you can definitely tell when she isn't brushed. And that is some drool slobber from Duke. So we're going to take that conditioner that we made up inside and spray that all over. always start with the rake but today I'm gonna do a rake because she's got a lot of undercoat as she's blowing coat on top of not being brushed so we're gonna do that
get slicker and I'll smooth the feathers and furnishings. Today I am drying with the K93. We have a ton planned for this summer and into early fall. We've got a ton planned and we are packing so much training into a few weeks. We have a water test coming up in two weeks and Duke and Boomer are both entered. So we really have to nail down um, our exercises that we're struggling on or any little things that we're struggling on. And then we had a dog show last weekend. I mean, it seems like every weekend we're doing something and we are going out of town. Boomer and I are going to train out of town um, with some people this weekend. And so it just seems like we are going nonstop. For people asking um, if we're doing dock diving this year, if we could fit it in, we would. And maybe if there's some trials in the fall that we can enter, we can. For Boomer, we're really focusing on water rescue as we only have so many summers and so we are just going to nail down um, we're wanting to nail down WRD this year and we're gonna do three tests and that's all we can do we live in Texas so we're kind of isolated with um, how many tests that we can travel to and from to so um, yeah and Molly will come along to Colorado we have a Colorado test coming up soon and so we'll take the whole crew and yeah, we've learned to travel really well together in a crossover. I just want to mention, I do not have an SUV. I have a crossover. Isn't that nuts? Yeah, that is it, you guys. That is all we have for you today. And we will catch you in the next one. Can you give me a kiss? Can you give me a kiss? Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. And this is sweet Molly. You should wait.